I'm single, and uh, <laughs> I'm not super picky. I got a couple rules as far as age. I'm not dating under 26, because I need you to be damaged a little bit. And <laughs> the highest I'm going is if I ask a woman her age, and she's like, you don't ask a woman her age. I'm like, that's too old for me. And <laughs> my second rule is my booty can't be bigger than yours, which is probably why I'm single, because I don't know if y'all noticed, I got that thing on me. That's right. I got that dunk. Yeah, I knew I had a big booty when I was like seven. I sat down, I was still the same height. I said, oh, snap. <laughs> yeah, I, I got this uh, from my mama. That's not true. Uh, my mom is the fastest person down the slip and slide, but I love my mom. She's great. Wait a minute. She's great. She's probably my favorite mom. If you don't got a mom, you gotta get you one. They're like dope, you know, but uh, <laughs> the trick is you gotta get one that likes you, because I got a dad, I don't think he liked me, because <laughs> Yeah, because anytime I'm born, he just dips, you know? But my mom, she was there when I was born. And she was there when all my siblings, I got three siblings, and I'm the youngest, that's why I'm happy. <laughs> Definitely can't be the oldest, you know? I did everything on my own! Nobody helped me! <laughs> that's the oldest. And the middle child's like, hey, I'm alive, just in case, if you need me. <laughs> and then the youngest is like, hey! Why is everybody so uptight? Come on, <laughs> come on. Yeah, by the way, I messed up again, but it's okay, mom forgives me. That's the, that's the youngest. But I need to hurry up and have kids before my eggs expire, especially because my mom, I feel like she treats me like a kid. You know, I love my mom, but she threw me a surprise SpongeBob SquarePants themed 29th birthday party. <laughs> nope, it's too late. Too late. I don't want my mom throwing me a surprise birthday party. I almost rather my dad throw me a surprise birthday party because that at least be a surprise. If, <laughs> if he just showed up who lives in a pineapple to see <laughs> you, apparently, where you been? My name is Preacher Lawson. Thank you so much. I appreciate it. This man is one of the best comedians I've ever been on yeah. this show. Preacher Lawson! <laughs> Howie! I'm just really upset. Why? Because I already used my golden buzzer. <laughs> to be honest with you, I'm just proud. I'm just proud. Me too. No other act is harder to do than somebody just bearing their soul, just bearing their sense of humor. No music, no fire, no nothing. It's just you and your mom's in the room. Oh! <laughs> What's up, mama? I'm proud of you. Yes. I love you. Love you. Heidi. I think you are the funniest comedian we've ever had. Wow. I really wow. do. Oh, thank and you. I have always had a very hard time with comedians, but with you, I always laugh, and I love the jeggings. <laughs> Mel B. Oh, you know I adore you, don't you? I love you. You know too. I do. <laughs> I mean, I was just saying before you came out, I cannot wait to belly laugh. And you didn't disappoint. You had me smiling and laughing, like, hysterically. Thank you. Simon. Uh, Preacher, you are just brilliant at what you do. I've never heard you repeat an act. No, yeah. It really yeah. shows for me that you've actually gone out on the road to build up a base, and that is hard work. And I've always thought something more is going to come your way. And maybe this is it, Preach. Maybe this is your time, because you are so brilliant at what you do. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. Preacher, the finals. Will it happen? We'll find out later. One more time for Preacher Lawson. I really like this guy. He's really funny. 